Hey minions, it's me Satan, your lord and master. Sorry we haven't done a video in a little bit. Apparently there's these videos out now in the community where people are roasting themselves. So I thought I would roast John Smith. So here we go. You are never a Christian. Prove it. You are not now. There is no such thing as I was once a Christian, but now I am not. If you're there, that is false. It's because you don't know the Bible. You're an idiot. Y-O-U-R. Well, I'm in Los Angeles. You have a problem with me? Come get some. I don't like your video. What's the point of it? Make one of your own religion. Really? Wikipedia is your source? Too lazy to read the books of Catholic scholars? I cannot take this seriously. And as long as it's not serious, that's fine. Call it strictly comedy. Otherwise, stop being so fucking lazy. You are pandering your cynicism to the lowest common denominator. This is as bad as prop comedy. Why don't you cherry pick every example of some local inept public official to show that all government officials are ineffectual? You are absolutely no better than those who find an example of any group that they choose to discredit and show examples of extreme behavior. I am so thankful for my Lord Jesus who died for me. I praise him constantly. He's my Lord, my best friend, my Savior. He is God in the flesh, and I can't wait for the day when I see him face to face. Come quickly, Lord Jesus. Okay then, goodbye, John. Enjoy your blasphemous YouTube channel, and soon the Antichrist will be here, and you can have all the devilish fun you want for a while. However, the day will come when you will bend your knee and confess to Jesus as Lord. Sadly, it will be too late. I truly, deeply feel sorry for you. Everything you say is discounted by 99.9% .9 of historians. You are just a guy who does not like the way God has decided to run his universe and, like a pouting child, is stomping his feet and whining that it isn't fair. Of course, you know that Jesus is God in the flesh. Otherwise, you would not be so obsessed with him. Jesus must really keep you up at nights. The more videos you make about how silly the Bible is, the more you reveal how much you hate God. Look, God is going to allow you to go to hell if you want to. It sounds like you would hate to spend eternity with him anyway. However, I think you're going to find that hell is much worse than you have ever imagined. Thankfully, my faith is based on the fact that Jesus has risen from the dead. I have eternal life thanks to him and I can't wait for him to return. Jesus is King of Kings and Lord of Lords. If you choose to reject him, it's your loss. May the God of Israel open your eyes and may you find the Savior. He is your only hope to find life. John, there is an incinerator down below. You have to be a maniac to get on God's bad side. Continually spitting in the microphone makes this impossible to listen to. I do like the music. How does all this hypocrisy and cognitive dissonance fit into one video? At the beginning, you make fun of idiot Christians who are idiots and were probably born stupid, or at least two stupid parents and could not help the stupidity they were taught and hold on to it because it's comfortable to be that stupid, I'm guessing. But it's okay to make fun of them, just not fatties, cool. What is sad is that a lot of people just blindly believe what atheists and others say about the Bible, creation, God, Jesus, etc. without actually checking to see if it's true for themselves. There are few who will. Click here for more information. Shut up, Satan. Lulz. You are all jerking off in a dark galaxy. O okay. John Smith said he likes jerking off in this galaxy because that's where all his porn is. Ugh, it's obvious the moon is a light source, dude. John, there is a god and a devil. The devil got you by the balls. It seems you changed sides and took the shortcut. There is a price to buy for taking that shortcut in the end. YouTube link. This whole atheist versus theist debates are just flat out retarded especially when mentioning the stupid phrase logical fallacies. People need to shut the hell up and get a goddamn job. Who cares about what other people think? Stupid fucking atheists. I agree, Robin. 
What you online atheists fail to understand is that the revelatory experience that the theists talk about exists. They just talk about it the way they do because... Ugh, too long, didn't read. It appears that you online atheists are too narrowly defined intellectually to grasp it. Try harder. This is boring. Yeah, I know, that last comment was pretty boring. Your video is mind-numbing. I can't bear a minute longer. I didn't watch the whole thing. The sarcasm and condescending tone was too much. But I do have a question for you. Blah, 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 atheists have no morals. Oh, goodness, another atheist clown complete with silly pictures and a funny voice to cash in on all those 12-year-olds they want to make a living from.